I'm the chief of Fort Mackay and uh, been a chief since 1986. For a long time, the community resisted the oil sands development because we wanted to maintain our traditional way of life. In 1982, there was a fur ban imposed in Europe, which dramatically affected our economy. Our people were all of a sudden faced with massive unemployment. The only option we had was either welfare or go to work. So our people went to work in the oil industry, and in 1986, we formed the Ford Mackay Group of Companies to help our community participate in the regional economy by finding employment. Port Mackay is unlike any other reserves across this country. We have really good housing. We also have uh, facilities in our community which is uh, maintained by the First Nations and uh, built by the First Nations. So we have a beautiful community with uh, really good people. And our community is uh, well off in the sense that our household income is $20,000 more than the Canadian average. I would describe uh, the relationship with Tech as formative and very good relationship in the sense that we establish rapport with uh, the people within Tech. One of the key issues for us was reclamation and Tech has promised that uh, reclamation will occur much more faster than current projects that aren't there. I think the people at Tech have been tremendous to work with and I'm quite satisfied with respect to how we arrive at creative solutions which will be a win-win for the oil industry and for Mackay.